Welcome back to the event rental shop and the event rental journey. In the second half of this video, we're gonna be sharing a fairly big update in our rental journey. But what has been going on so far, I wanted to kind of share that. We're of course still doing deliveries, unloading, loading. And in fact, I'm probably doing, I don't know, maybe 30% of all that myself in March and April. Although that will decrease as we are actively hiring uh, more and more people and I will be doing less. We had a massive order of furniture, mostly tables to kind of fulfill some of the orders we have uh, coming up for this, uh, this season. So here we are unloading the truck. So this is literally the biggest order of furniture we've ever had and a little deceiving rental guy is taking half of this order uh, later on and uh, but yeah we actually had to buy a secan another secan just to accommodate uh, just to put this stuff somewhere and a little nicer one this time compared to last secan purchase this is a little bit of a snippet of the yard here so we set up a little tent up here as well keep some of this pipe out of the weather one day we'll have a forklift but we just have to use brute force to put everything into those sea cans still doing staging uh, this is an outdoor stage we did so that's kind of cool and also doing some indoor events uh we're part of this big one we delivered 300 chairs fairly large event at the convention center here in town So this is the big announcement. We bought an SL75 mobile stage line uh, stage. So, and you'll see this, some footage here coming up. When we first kind of started looking at this, we didn't realize that these things are expensive. In fact, it is the most expensive thing other than the house that I'm here in that we have ever purchased and by we it, we purchased it uh lee and i purchased the stage rental guy uh and uh, myself i will be operating it here in town lee is not in the same town as me uh although in the future we might purchase something for him he'll operate it and then we'll split the profits that way um so we're really working together it's exciting and it's serious stuff. We actually had to do a two day training course. And here is, um, I'm sure you're watching the footage now. Uh, and that's from the training course. Although we are picking up the stage. We don't have it yet. We are picking it up in like a month and a half or something. I think end of May. And we'll of course have a separate video about that. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna talk about a little bit about this stage. But uh, super excited because that kind of adds a whole new thing to our business. And, uh, and uh, the journey continues. So in real life, I swear it looks much bigger. But you just saw the stage in its trailer mode. Here it is set up. The footage you just saw there with the stage set up was from the second day of training. Unfortunately... The first day of training was cold, it was wet, um, but we of course managed. And then it certainly warmed up on the second day, which was, uh, uh, which we were, we were super happy with. So the training essentially involved us setting the stage up, taking it down, 
and repeating that process several times as there are so many little things that uh, you really need to know in order to properly install these stages. We send three to four people for let's say a 40 by 40 tent. It takes us two to three, maybe four hours to install those tents and then almost the same amount of time to take them down. With these stages, and one of the reasons we were attracted to them from kind of a business standpoint, is that two people can install this stage in 30 to 45 minutes under ideal conditions. So I really thought prior to taking the course, this would be fairly easy to just whip together and uh, install these stages, but it's quite an intricate process and I now see why stage line uh, really pushes for training for these stages. Um, otherwise, you know, if you do anything wrong here, you can really uh, damage very, very expensive parts. Some of these parts are over $10,000 each uh, just for the parts um, or hurt someone. So um, yeah, we are very happy that we went to the course. And in fact, later in the year, I'm going to try to get more people certified uh, just so we can have additional certified staff to watch the stage when necessary. Our trainer had 30 years of stage experience. Uh, so it was, it was really nice to kind of be with someone for two days that was in that kind of rental realm that is completely new to you. And so you learn so much and it's nice to be on that curve uh, once in a while um, instead of uh, kind of knowing everything about tables, tents, and, and it's not, so it's kind of fun to be on a new learning curve. So here we are installing uh, some walls at the back and soon after we will be raising the roof of the stage with the hydraulic system. If you want to see more stage line setups in the future, consider joining me on the rental journey by subscribing. We very much appreciate it. Guys, take it easy and we'll see you soon.